Hello, welcome back to my next video. Because so many people do temperature measurements, I'll do that too. The top of the stove is the hottest part, because the outlet of the riser pipe sits just below the plate. And as the hot gases are flowing down, they give off heat to the drum and therefore cool down. You can see that here. When the stove door is closed, the primary air comes from under the floor, through that flexible pipe. Then the air is preheated by the firebox. And now we measure up again. I have a not too large fire because my meter only measures up to 400 degrees Celsius. When the flue gases enter the flue pipe, it's cooled further. Well, it would be even better to make an extra loop of pipe to exchange more heat before it exits through the chimney. But my wife didn't like the idea of this big black pipe going through the room. find more and more of these grey pieces in the ash. I suspect it's uh, high temperature iron oxide. So I'll have to do an inspection of the interior. For a sewer problem that I once had, I ordered this endoscopic device in Hong Kong and now I can use it to inspect my rocket stove without disassembling it. You have to get used to it. It's easy to lose your orientation, which will you see. First I go in. And there the white stuff is the fireproof concrete casted box. There is some unburned charcoal. And then I turn upwards to the hole, to the riser. Yeah, upwards, go. And there's the mild steel tube there with the fins to generate the vortex. And they are damaged, I can see now. The way this device works is that it is a USB device, sort of webcam, you could say. And I can see the result on my monitor of my PC. That's what you see happening here. So let's see, this is the vertical part of the secondary air pipe, which is also affected. Let's see how the stainless steel riser pipe looks. So we go up, well, still looks pretty good, there is some ash I guess, but not these loose parts. But the vortex veins, veins look bad. All three. This is the first one. It's it's damaged and the, at the top. That's the, it's the that's the hottest part. There's another one. Also damaged on the same spot. And the third one also damaged the same way. Okay, so I've seen enough. I'm going, going out again. And all 
the way it counts. So we get light now. Yes, there we go. Let's have a look at myself. Yes, you can do that too. Okay, um, the secondary air pipe. How is that? Another inspection. All the way down. Here's the 30 degrees angle. And yes, there is uh, some damage there too. <coughs> because it's the hot part of the pipe. So, and here is another uh, picture with the endoscope with a starting fire. So I will retract my hand and the camera when it's getting too hot. Meanwhile you can listen to the music. 